Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and today's Manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Tokyo Ghoul Re chapter 151 and last chapter of Tokyo Ghoul Re, oh my god, I fucking called it. I knew something like this was going to happen but I, I couldn't fucking believe it that we got the ghouls uniting with the CCG to get to save Kaneki. I I'm so fucking happy to see this happen. It makes me so happy that Hide got this to happen. It, it really legit makes me happy, especially since we even got Suzuya on our side too. Oh my God. But I just have this feeling because I was just thinking about this. I got a feeling that Suki is going to fuck this up somehow. Just got this little feeling that Mitsuki is going to fuck this up. Anyway, let's get to this chapter and see what happens next. In order to take back Tokyo, the CCG has joined hands with ghouls. What is their plan? And this chapter is titled Get Out. Here we go. Special Joint Countermeasures HQ. Um, uh, in our Bozy um, Wordos, I don't know, I think it means weirdos, but whatever. Fucking typo. <sighs> I literally just woke up like two minutes ago, so anyway. Cinnabogo had a uh, winner a la, oh, it was weirdo. <laughs> Cinnabogo had a uh, wide winner a la Van Doy, and as Wendy, Airy, um, Gumpo, Resum, any, uh, um, Pandor, Poga, Daza, Bigo, uh, Hemp, Hondo, Dema, Wollum. <gasps> we get to talk to the people from the underground ward. 24 Ward. Oh my god. They've gone on to, um, well, well, it's been, do, been a Wally stem dem. Look at Suzuya. Suzuya's like, what the fuck is going on? Um, stem dem. Steamed him, huh? Figo Wanda Ro. Hada Huda Jamba? Hada Huda Angor? I see. And then, uh, uh, Narka, uh, wait. Nagara, oh, wait. Nagaraja Underground started destroying everything. In order to stop it, their king, um, uh, they all attacked it at once. How did you even understand a word of that crap? Seriously, how did you? <laughs> Sorry. It didn't look like they were making much of a dent, but whenever they took one of the, ki uh, the king's eyeballs, his stomach dulled somewhat. They finished uh, destroying all of its eyeballs, and some amount of time later, the king finally stopped his movements and apparently turned to stone. Ooh. Eyeballs. That's it. As Kagane materializes in places that RC cells cluster, um, eyeball patterns are often observed. An RC cell uh, cells cluster most densely near uh, Kakahau, so it's likely that um, Kakahau equipped main um, body is, is in the vicinity of those eyeball things, right? Indeed. Ooh, that's interesting. So we've got to flip every eyelid, eh? Doesn't spare us much trouble. Yes, but this is still a massive development. And it was made possible by information brought from the 24th Ward. Thank you so much, Kirishima. Guess something came out of me digging halfway through the earth. Ayato! I still wish we would have gotten to see Ayato save Toka. Like, it still bugs me that we didn't get to see it. Show that to y'all, guys. Just give me a minute. The hell are you getting all bashful about, huh? Piss off. Getting thanked by a human. It feels weird. <laughs> Squirm, I love you. I, I love you, Ayato. We don't have much time till, until it resumes its activity, which means we are currently in, a, in need of a method to find Ken Koneki near those eyeballs. If only we found... Uh, oh, sorry. If only we could pinpoint the re irregularity of his body amidst all that. A way to search out a human from a sea of our sea cells, huh? We could use the technology that power our sensor gates, no? No, we don't have time to cobble together devices. We need to use what we already have. Infrared? Nope. What about sonar? Not a bad idea. There should be something about our sea cell, cell wave, uh, 
um, transception experiments in Kano's, in Kano's notes. What did the good doctor leave us? Howdy. Miss, you're sure um, pretty doing anything at the moment? Hmm? <gasps> what's this feeling? I get, what's this? I get this feeling we've met before. I learned, um, at Gory, uh, Tree, Kano's people were holding you captive. I looked for you endlessly. We had those bastards on the run. But I never thought I'd find you again at the CCG of all places. Neither did I. Nishiki. I'm so happy to see them together. It makes me so happy. Um, I'm happy to see you again, but I... I walked to Professor Kano's side on my own two legs. What? Kano was walking far from the human path, but there was simply no one like him in the world of goology. That's precisely why I chose to become his assistant. Woo! His intentions were entirely medical. He was trying to um, engender a situation in which the country would have no choice but to pursue ghoul research. After re the revolution, I will be... Um, Branded a heinous criminal, I doubt I'll be able to do much research at all. Ken Kaneki was but a huge bomb to draw the world's eye, eyes to the issue itself. How fatally boring. I'm telling you, Kano is the true troll. He was the one pulling... Oh, jeez. I said it, I think I said it two weeks ago. Kano was the one pulling all the motherfucking string. His eyes aside, I wanted the man's knowledge. For what? To make my dreams come true. To live uh, without blame and uh, censure as a human beside you, a ghoul. A ghoul. For that, I need, needed to change the prevailing human ethos, the attitude of ghoul extermination. That huge kakuja is made of a special sub substance known as... Uh, Pluripo uh, pluripotent cells, aka stem cells, that's what it says in the translation notes. And if um, research into RC cells spurred uh, medical advancement, then maybe the attitude towards ghouls would kill me. Do you really think humans will look at the monstrous thing and think to, um, to draw closer to ghoul kind? How many humans has it killed? Look at that thing. I almost wish I wasn't a, uh, I almost wish I myself wasn't a ghoul. Nishiki, are you calling that thing a ghoul? If its main body really is um, Kaneki, yes, then yes. Kaneki is a human, isn't he? Not a ghoul. But a man became that. And you ghouls are helping solve the problems a man created. Ooh, Kimmy makes a good point. Kimmy makes a really interesting point. But at the same time, Oh, it took me a second to understand this. What she means by a man created that. Because, remember, Kaneki is half human, right? And also, like, I feel like she's also saying, remember, Kano created that. Created Kaneki. Um, you know, his ghoul, por ghoul side. And I feel like that's what you, I feel like it's a double meaning. And I'm very curious what you guys think. If it's a double meaning, like that about Kaneki being half ghoul, and also like Dr. Kano creating it to boot. And because I think she knew, I think Kimi knows that um, that Dr. Kano and what that's what she means why it's uh um it's bold, because you notice it's bold by man, uh bold and man. Because remember what Dr. Kano said. This was going according to his plan. He wanted this shit to happen. So I'm telling you, that man is a fucking troll. Anyway. Please follow the posted directions. The police will um, direct you from here. Please remain in line as you move. Okay, don't worry, everyone. I hear it's just sleeping. We ghouls are pretty cute. Aww. We'll be staying the night again. I'm going back to uh, the countermeasures room for a little. Uh, you guys should rest up here. Aye, aye, sir. Um, Roger, you, uh, you take care of yourself too, squad leader. Yuri! I really hope, I really can't wait.
wait to see how Yuri plays a role in saving Kaneki. Yuri, special class. It appears that even ghouls are helping in the evacuation efforts. Don't make me laugh. After the appearance of a beast like that, nothing seems strange in comparison. I suppose you have a point. I heard something interesting from Murad about the underground king, I, I assume? The info from the those 24th ward residents, huh? Yes. That is the one, um, that is one of the Washu's taboos. That true, that thing's true identity is the one-eyed ghoul of the Washu. It was of the Washu, but it hated us. It faced the, um, old CCG head on and was driven underground. We what? I had heard that King Kaneki's Kagane was taken from someone from the Washu lineage. Perhaps that is why that thing has taken its chosen form. It all comes back to Rize. If I were one to retrace history, I would push this um, new above ground king down below. Special class, why are you helping us? Cool blood runs in my veins too. Proud, terrible blood. And soon all will know. Uh, I think I should buy myself some favors in advance. Besides, I have a few people I need to thank. The people who actually killed my father. What? What? Are you serious? <gasps> the hell is with these guys? They don't care whether you're ghoul or human. <gasps> oh shit! Like, what in the world? Asleep. Oh, look at Hide. Asleep, is he? The GSDF, the police, the CCG, and the ghouls. Kind of crazy if you think about it. I wonder. Isn't that mascot? <laughs> huh? Want me to take it off? Oh, come on. It's embarrassing. But you're right. It gets pretty steamy in here. Yes, yes, take it off, take it off, take it off, take it off, take it off. Hmm, well, whatever, might as well. Ah, the breeze. Don't tease us, Ishida. So then, I re uh, so then, I've removed my mask. Time to get beneath yours too, Toka. When did you start liking him? What? Come on. When I recklessly went up against um, those doves, did you give them too much bird seed? Oh, doves? <laughs> If you died, I'd be sad. That's what he said. I guess that was when. No way. That skit managed to say something like that. I feel like I was getting always. I feel like I was always getting saved by him. I hope. I hope I'll be um, able to save him this time. Well, uh, we'll give it our best. Shida. Shida, you are trolling us right now with this. You are trolling us right now with this. I want to see that bottom half of the face. Don't do this to me right now. This is a huge troll. It's 7.15 in the morning and I want to see this face. So what about the wedding? Seriously? Come on. Tell me, where was the honeymoon? Did he give you a ring? Well, um, well... The ring I... I gave it to him. The ring! It's somewhere inside that huge body. Next issue in search of, the, of a ring. <gasps> That's going to be the key to find, to, to saving Kaneki. Is going to be that ring. That's going to be the key. Oh my god. Oh my god. God, this was such a good chapter. We got the reunite and we got to see Mishiki and Kimmy reunite. I thought that was so sweet. I, I think all of us have been waiting for that. All of us have been waiting for to see Mishiki and Kimmy come out, uh, reunite. It was interesting to find out um, what happened to the uh, 
One Eye King of the 24th Ward, um, the underground One Eye King. That was really interesting. Yeah. He was turned into stone, and we and we learned uh, about like the we learned the truth about the eyes, um, which are uh, on on the Kaganes, uh, which are the twi- which are the um, uh, basically clusters of our C cells. So now we got to wonder here: what's going to happen? when they destroy all 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 the eyes is Kaneki going to turn stone is he going to come back in human form like what's going to happen and I'm, I'm very curious what you guys you guys think about that do you think and and where that eye is opening and i'm wondering if Ishida did this on purpose do you guys think that's where the ring is? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to contribute to my channel expansion, there's a few ways you can do that. You can donate to um, my uh, PayPal, Patreon, or purchase something off my Amazon wish list. All those um, links are in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter. Follow my Twitch channel for me on PlayStation Network. All that's in the description box as well. And until next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later.